The Quitters, Quitters Guide, Chapter 8, would be Locking Yourself Away in a Vault. Now, when I say lock yourself away in a vault, like some days to quit, you just got to lock up your habits. You got to lock them away. It's kind of like your fingernails see your cuticles, like so many aspects of your fingernails like the white part that's the good part that's the good stuff the pink part that's that's like your tribal quest like the actual quest to the good stuff and like locking away your habit like underneath your fingernails like looking underneath your fingernails how many bad habits do you see so you just gotta wash hands, keep your hands clean. Constantly stay washing your hands though. The cleaner the hands, the more you can smoke. If you have to, just take a shower, stay wet. Once, a, once again, oils does the body good. Um, uh, it's kinda like a treasure chest. Your fingernail is a treasure chest. Why would you keep goodies with bad stuff? Once you have a whole collection of goodies, like the more clean the room is, the more you know you can eat everything in the room too. And he gave his own speck of shine. The room would probably light up if you treat it like goodies. If your room was made out of goodies, you locked out goodies in your treasure chest. There you got a you got a meal for the day. Somewhere in there though. To lock it up, you had to lock you up. And that's what that kind of leads to. Like those bad habits could get you locked away. Well, lock it away in your soul. And the ultimate cap, just have an all white like cap. The more you lock it away, the wider the cap got. And you just lock it out into the hairs of the galaxy. Uh, definitely go for all white diet. All white diet on the inside could probably teach you how to lock away your bad habits too. Um, definitely a lot of white objects. Um, and just being wise and like your ass. The more you like act out like this screenplay in your hands, the whole point is not to set your book of life on fire. You gotta grow, evolve, have resolutions. Like what were some of your goals for the year? Write down what you did with the times and how they accumulated to the goals. Cause more than anything, I wanna know what you're doing with your time. No, just sitting there wasting time. No procrastinating. The whole key is to keep getting some work done at all times. Keep working away on something. Like, the more you dedicated your time to figuring out how to solve your problems, the more it worked out. And just keep digging in yourself. It's kind of like digging in your nose, but go. Well, that go happened to be like a good way to quit smoking. If you actually just dig in your nose and wash your hands when you finish. Or you can sit there going cold turkey. And cold turkey, that was a like had cold feet. Somewhere in there having cold feet. Like it explains how the land, when it's cold, you probably don't want to smoke, bruh. Probably should be trying to quit the most. Because when it's cold, it's the holidays. And you're going to have a lot of company. It's going to be a lot of food. A lot of good food, stuff like that. And a lot to just do. Like, more than anything, lock away your bad habits into the soles of your feet. If you have to, just squash them up. Let them evaporate like smoke. And just concentrate on making like this energy drink to quit smoking on it from the inside out. Be the most characteristics of the character that didn't do it though. Like what would he be doing at that time?
And try to go deep into the zone, memorizing who you are. And it may take months, years, but don't give up on figuring yourself out what makes you tick in the morning. Like, what were your main aspects of starting off the day? Of course, brush your teeth, wash your face, take a shower, and get some work done. Just tell me as as managing your time where your time went. 